We're going to carry on our look ahead to the North London derby, Tottenham against Arsenal. That's what we've got to look forward to, folks, when we come back this weekend. And what a game. We're going to do that with Nord VPN, And we're going to do it with Arsenal Invincible, Martin Keown. Uh, Martin, you've got an ally in Ryan, who's a big Arsenal fan. Martin's absolutely right. I mean, just listen to yourselves and how you speak about Arsenal. No, that must be you and me, Simon. No other club gets treated this shambolically by the media. Is that right? I don't really care what you what you're saying. Going to tell me about Arsenal? I, I just look at what happened at, at the weekend, and I think that was an unfair situation for Arsenal to have to deal with. But you you put it to one side, don't you? You use that as oxygen for this yes. next game, and the, the game against Spurs um, is always you're going into that cauldron of of, uh, of anticipation with the fans. Start of a new season. Spurs already lost a game against Newcastle. Um, but I've said already that I think this is, um, I like what Spurs are doing. I like the way that they play. I like the unity in the stadium. I like the togetherness. Uh, it's a difficult situation. I think maybe now they'll probably be concentrating more on themselves. The last time Arsenal went there, of course, it was more about, wasn't it? Okay, um, you know, Arsenal went there looking to, to win a game of football to become champions, you know? Um, now maybe the new manager is setting a new culture and they've got their own, their only, their own trophies they want to win. It's been a long time. So we have to respect Spurs and it's difficult. You want to go there with your best players, but they're not there, of course. You want to hope, obviously, Calafuri is another one who's picked up an injury. Uh, Moreno is the new signing, the boy who would have come in for Rice. It's not been a lucky start for Arsenal. But what they have to do now is make their own luck and go into that cauldron and come out with some points. Is the gap widening, Martin? Well, there's always talk about this gap in the North London derby between Tottenham and Arsenal. At the moment, is it widening? No, I, I think Spurs are not. There's not too much between the two teams. While, whilst there's been this sort of uh, period of without a trophy, we're 21 years now. Arsenal won the Premier League. I don't, God knows how many years it's been since Spurs won a trophy worth picking up. So that's just, you know they're, they're in the similar boat. Arsenal won it, you know copious amounts of FA Cups. Um, Son is a player that you know might be the, the difference. Kuliszewski, they've they're, they're looking at Solanke now coming in. He's been injured. He's been out. Maybe he's had a good period for him, and this is the, when he you know. Starts kick springboard for his start of his his career at Spurs proper because he hasn't really hit the ground running yet, but he's had a, he's had an injury. You, so you said there's not too much between the there's teams. Miles between. I don't mean there is. I, I, miles so that suggests that I Tottenham think when you, might be title challenger. When you go to Spurs, later. when you go to Spurs at home, it's a difficult experience right now. When you saw the way they blew Everton away and what their their home record last season, they get a really good start to the Premier League season. You don't go there thinking, oh, you're favourites automatically. We, ne Whenever you went to, you had to put out the fire for Spurs. You had to earn the right to play, and that's what Arsenal will have to do. I expect Arsenal to, the, the to have the majority the of, the, huge, of the possession. Man. 23 not... points between the two teams last season. Yeah, but Jim, the, I just feel that there's Basuma in there, Madison, Saar. They've got decent players. I like their full-backs. I like the way that they play. Their full-backs bush, pushing up. Do you expect up. Spurs to be finishing anywhere near Arsenal? This is the same person that wrote an article saying he wouldn't put a single Tottenham player in his Arsenal lineup. Shoot, bless me. Um, I, don't, bless I, I don't think... I think Tuesday. Arsenal are better and I think Tuesday they're closer case. to City. But I don't, yeah. I'm not dismissive. And City, and City are brilliant and I'm miles not, away. I'm not so an Arsenal fan City, who's dismissive Spurs, Spurs, Spurs. As much as I like Spurs and Daniel's my friend as has been well established and oh, rehearsed nice. by Jim on every week, every opportunity he can. That's nice. Spurs are not as good as Arsenal. Arsenal are miles beyond Spurs right now. Well, we're very early in the season and, and, I'm, and, and it concerns me the, the level of difficulty when you're going to Villa, you're going to Spurs, you're going to Man City. This is a job now when Arsenal need to show what they're really made of. What champions are made what of. What players are coming back from, from international duty. When you play international football, you don't really want to be playing away from home. That's what I will say. So it's about and bringing, the, Republic, well, about bringing the group together and making sure that everybody's ready to go. And it, you've got to see this as almost like a, a must-win game because you it, to keep pace with City, uh, and they make for a very difficult opponent, Spurs. So no one's going into that game taking the Spurs lightly. Would it be all. something of a shock, though, if Tottenham find a way of beating Arsenal on Sunday? I think it probably would, yeah. I think it would um, be a huge blow, that's for certain. That means there's but a big I don't, gap. I don't see that happening though, Jim. I think Arsenal is still good enough. When you look at how many goals they conceded in recent times, the number of clean sheets away from home, their away record, that's when you start to look at Arsenal and think, OK, they are, they've got that pedigree now of champions because of their away record. is quite phenomenal okay. the last so number of matches. It? I'm always going to go with Arsenal. But I tell you, it's going to be, if, you, if you earn anything at Spurs now, when you go away from home, they won't lose too many games. Mm. You earn everything you get now, right now, to play at Spurs. Jim White and Simon Jordan.
Monday to Friday mornings from 10 on AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.